What's up YouTube, RBI here, RBI Crew 7, in a car, by myself, with a new phone, so hopefully the video camera works well in this, apparently I upgraded heavily according to the guy, but we will find out, so, well, hey, it's uh, 7.35 our time here, been up since about 6 o'clock, normally I don't wake up until 7, 8 o'clock, so, up early, if you guys have been following us on social media, on Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter, we are en route to Louisville for the one day card show on Saturday, June 4th. Hopefully this video gets uploaded before then. Um, all depends on the Wi-Fi at the hotel. I actually just lowered our data package. I'm gonna get a little, little talking here about just life and everything, but, but I got some things to talk about. There's a reason in this video we're two months out of something kind of big. Um, you guys lowered my data package, so I need to watch my data usage, so I'm playing a video on mine could kill it and then I don't want to pay more I just lord my bill blah 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 yada yada over the best part right so recording a video got some things to talk about first off I hope everyone is doing well the last video you guys saw was of my shot heard around the world that is still yet to land I think it's in Europe right now going across the the, the ball that I hit the crushed no um the ball the gender reveal that when my wife and I had that uh, got recorded and you actually recorded and uploaded. I didn't even know you did that, which was cool because we had like five different videos with all angles and that was an angle we didn't get. And good job, Neil. You actually did a good job recording that one. You didn't shake or whatever. Just giving me a hard time. He's actually in the car with Tyson right now. So, the uh, I'm having a boy. And thank you for everybody for the kind words, the congratulations. We are both very thrilled. I personally did not care if it was a boy or a girl. I just want a healthy baby, and right now we're, we're good, and everything's up to par. We're at like 22 weeks, so we're over halfway. We're both excited. Life is uh, life is a change for me, boys and girls, children of all ages. I'm going to be a father to a human being, because I have two dogs that I'm fathers to that I love very much. But uh, we're excited. We're very blessed and excited, and uh, it's been a... Uh, been, I, I had two dreams in life, you know, get a little personal for a second, why not, we haven't talked in a while, right, two dreams in life, one was to obviously do what I do now, own a card shop, which has come true, thanks again everybody for that, and the other one was to be a father, so I'm, I'm very, very excited to fulfill both of my dreams in life, and uh, yeah, just excited, just very excited, so um, yeah, yeah, that's pretty much that to go with that. So, a little personal stuff. But besides that, we're doing great. The wife's doing great. Um, she's keeping me very busy. We're doing a billion things to our house before the little one gets here. And for those of you asking, and and uh, as Seven said in this video and messaged me on Instagram, name it Mutual. I ran that by the wife for you, Michael. Uh, nah, didn't didn't work. Uh, my. Probably also that the fact that my brother's dog named Stan after Stan Mutual and Stan the Man. So, but I tried for you. I did. I did. So that was a great video you did. Thanks for the uh, the. You did pretty good. Spot on. You kind of nailed me. So I, I don't think I'm gonna be going that way in this video first off because I'm driving and I'm trying to more pay attention to the road than anything. Then uh, Mark. Kind of gave me a hard time for this, but no, actually, I'm, I'm looking at the road. That's why the glasses kind of make you think I'm looking, but I'm actually paying attention. Driving to Louisville to pick up bundles and then go to the show. So we'll get, if you guys please follow us on social media. We'll have a lot of footage over the weekend, but I've got a busy month of June with cards. We have a trade night coming up. I'm going to talk about that. And then there's something very important I'm going to talk about that we're only two months out of. If you guys are going to this thing on the East Coast, we'll get to that too. So let's fire up. See if I can get I'm, I'm trying to have my little coffee. I don't normally drink these anymore, but I'm out of routine. I, I can't have my normal coffee at home. I can't have my normal breakfast. I got to get on the road unless I want to get up an extra half an hour. That's not happening. So, all right. First weekend, June, which we're now at the 3rd and 4th. June 4th is the Louisville One Day Card Show that Chase puts on at Louisville Sports Card Shop out in Louisville, which we enjoy going to. A couple shops in town we like to go to. So that's going on this week, and that's where we're going to be at. We will obviously have video footage, a vlog, you name it. Now, next week is my card slash guy slash no shop owner slash vacation with the guys that usually takes place in the fall. However, 
I gave a call to my buddy Josh BB whenever I found out we were having a kid wife or I was told I could finally tell people and brought the news to him that hey bad news we'll not be able to come to Sausage Fest it's October he's like why and I'm like well it's because the child that's going to be born out of my wife that's my kid on October 1st and so he's like what do you mean we can do it this summer so we're going to Sausage Fest next weekend in Minnesota very pumped very excited we leave on Friday we come back Monday a lot of social media I know Neil's going to get a lot of videos but to be honest with you guys, this one is going to be the least amount of cards we've ever done, which is going to be very exciting. Uh, Michael Sevens, we're going to do our best to come out and visit you at the liquor store. We missed you last time, but I'm going to do my best to get out there. Um, so, we're going to the Twins uh, versus the Red Sox game on Friday night. Saturday, actually Saturday day, I can't even talk about it. It's a surprise. Josh told me I'm not allowed to tell. we got a fun Saturday set in store during the day. Saturday night, we actually will do our card night, trade night at Three Star Sports Cards in um, Roseville, Minnesota. And then Sunday, we're going to get up. I think there's a group of 16 of us. We're all going to go golfing. And then we're going to go boating after that on Josh's boat on his lake. And then on Monday, I'll come back home. And there goes my my true guy vacation this year. That's that's it. That's, uh, that's my sausage fest. So we are very excited. I know Neil is really itching to get to this one because uh, I don't give him any days off. He gets off Sundays. So that's his choice. He can take off, but I have to take off a lot now with the doctors and stuff. So, but that's what's going on next week in the what are we looking at? The 11th, 10th, 11th, 12th. Then the following weekend, June 18th, Saturday, is the Machinist Sports Card Show here in St. Louis that we cross promote with and handle the social media that's going on. It's been a great show since starting a year and a half ago. We're very honored to be able to handle the social media and help support the show. So that's what's going on June 18th. And then June 25th, finally, another trade night. We haven't had one since trade weekend. June 25th is trade night 26, guys. That's back at the shop. Again, that's only once a year we go down the street or I've rented a place for two days. That's Saturday, June 26th. Doors open at 10 a.m. Go until probably midnight. BGS submissions, guys. Uh, we had a great turnout last time. We are getting more and more grades in. I want to thank you all for that. So you guys have... Less than a month, you're at like three weeks or three and a half weeks to get me all your grades in for a 10-day submission. If you would like details, feel free to comment below. I will get a hold of you, message us. You can also reach us in social media at RBI Crew 7 on our Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. You can message us there or go to the website that I work so eversly hard on, lying. Neil does it all, www.rbicrew7.com, and you can reach us through there. So... If you want to get those grades in, we need them in before then. Obviously, I'll ship them out on that following Monday or Tuesday. 10-day submission. We'll get them back. Boom. Then, July gets pretty dead, which is going to be very nice because I have a lot to do in July getting to prepared for this thing that literally starts two months from this exact moment that I'm talking to you guys. August 3rd in a place called Atlantic City, which I've never been to. There is this thing called the El Nationals or La Nationals or the Nationals. National Sports Cards Collectors Convention, guys, is going on. RBI Crew 7 will be set up this year again. We're very excited to finally get to the East Coast. We have not been there since Chantilly, geez, five, six years ago. So, you guys are probably like, where the heck are you guys at? We are at 857 and 861. We have two 10 by 15 booths. There's a group of us going. We'll be representing with Sports Car Direct. We'll have Sports Car Direct stuff there. Darren is not, unfortunately, not going to be able to make it this year. He's got so much going on with his son. So, a uh, happy anniversary to Darren at SportsCarDirect.com. They just hit their four years, if I'm correct. I believe it was. I'm pretty sure he said four. I haven't had enough coffee yet, so I'm pretty sure it's four. So, Sports Car Direct did set it up. It will be advertised as Sports Cards Direct's boost. If you look at the things, that's where we'll be at. Obviously, we will be supporting the site as always excited about sports card direct turning four and we've got setting up with us we'll have my son you guys if you guys need a, not my real son my card son they all call it my cancellary will be set up as well as harry potter known as mike langhammer mr tyson magdorn mr magdorn will be set up this year as well as jason galeski and the effort the amazing john yates bundles cuddles you name it john yates will be there so we're very excited to get there, guys. I have been working very, I'm sorry, we, there you go, Neil, you have been too, but we've been working very hard getting ready for Nationals, so that's why I need the whole month of July. I have so much back stock, guys, right now. I cannot keep up. 
that's another reason why we have mail do videos the shop has just been extremely busy thank you we're truly blessed about that but there's just so much i can do on a daily basis and when we got to attain the customers customers come to number one when they come in plus the amount of lots that's been walking in how much stuff we've been buying everything keeps getting pushed back so july is going to be working very hard to bring as much inventory as we can to nationals i i've been back stocking a lot of big really awesome cards very hard to find cards yeah that i i have not been sharing on social media that i'm only bringing nationals um i'm i'm very excited guys because at the same time this will be my sounds like the official last card trip that i myself get to travel on for the remainder of 2016 will be nationals i think the wife well the wife has put the kibosh on me traveling i'm going to do my best to be in chicago in november it's like the third weekend of november i think i can maybe swing that my baby should be about two months old but then again i may not want to go by then i may not you know i don't have a child yet so maybe i want to be around and not go but uh, regardless neil will be there in chicago in november set up in our normal spot and then we will be in cincinnati on the following week and thanksgiving weekend for black friday neil will be representing there as well i will 100 percent not be at the cincinnati one i will not be doing the fall ones anymore myself personally army actor seven will i've already made it clear that thanksgiving is a very important day to me and i do not want to go anywhere i love to host thanksgiving and watch football and with the baby i'm not gonna try to travel on a lot of holidays so not to go off subject, I was just saying how much important Nationals is to me, and because I get to see a lot of people I get to see once a year, especially people that I finally get to meet who are on the East Coast that haven't come west, and uh, we're just excited. It's Nationals, guys. We're only two months out. 857, 861 are boost. We're actually in a really good spot. Um, we're down in, like, the, I think the main aisle, like, the main square where all the corporate is, like, we're on, like, an aisle, and we're right there, and apparently the bathrooms are behind us, which are great, because a lot of people can go to the bathroom. I'll get the map out. If you guys go to the, I think it's NSCC, I think, National Sports Club, yeah, NSCC.com, I think, there is a uh, thing you go to for the floor plan. You can see that. Eventually, I'll get more technical with that. I just wanted to let you guys know, hey, we're coming. If you didn't know, here's our booth numbers, 857-861. We're excited. We will do... Um, we will be doing some giveaways like we did in the past. Last year, I think we as a group gave away over $500 in shopping spree between the group of us. We'll do something similar this year. So you obviously just have to come see us and social media out. But we'll be giving away shopping sprees within our core group of guys. We'll discuss that in time, and I'll be letting you guys know. So I'm not in my normal fired up mode, everything, because it's I'm actually usually... Right now, I'm actually still in bed, usually. At the time I'm recording this, I've been driving for an hour. I'm usually still in bed right now. But, I mean, I may have been woken up by the dog. Because the other dog, my little one, my cute little baby girl, she, she let daddy sleep. The other one used to let daddy sleep. Now he just wants to get up and play. And he's like seven. So, so yeah. So, I'm not in my normal, woo, I don't even know what, I can't even see a time on here. I don't even know if we're doing a long RBI video. So, um... That's pretty much what's going on with RBI Crew 7. Again, guys, I hope you've been following us on social media via Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter. I do apologize. I know a lot of people have been messaging us, asking us to do more videos. We are doing our honest to God truth best. It's just, I can only, I sometimes when we get in early, I need to get caught up on paperwork and shipping and all the fun stuff you guys don't see in a card shop that goes behind the scenes. Literally, the, the, the fun stuff. Um, and right now with the wife she gets off at five i get off at six she's been etching me to get off early every day we still stay up until six neil's there but we got so much going on going baby shopping we got to go doctor visits all that stuff so my time's been very limited actually as of the past three weeks tuesdays have been my work from home days because i've been trying to catch up plus we've been doing stuff like doctors blah 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 you know all that fun stuff but so we're doing our best to get more videos, doing everything we can. I know Neil's going to do a, a very awesome vlog next week for Sausage Fest in Minnesota. He's going to capture a lot of the fun we're doing, so we'll be, uh, I'm eager to see how many hours I pay him to work on that vlog. Just kidding. Um, I'm assuming he'll get one in Louisville. I'm, I'm thinking he'll get you guys one this weekend. We'll definitely get a tour of the show as we always do. We'll, we'll be social meeting in and out. Again, I don't know if this video is going to get uploaded 
be like today or like when I get home tomorrow night. I don't know. So those videos going on in Louisville might have happened. It just depends on the Wi-Fi in the hotel room. Sometimes it works great. Sometimes it doesn't. So that's pretty much it. Obviously, I'm not showing off any cards in this video. I've got obviously a ton to show as Nationals approaches. I will be giving you guys a sneak peek. We always do a, a rough setup of what we're bringing and give you guys a sneak peek in a video before anybody be, be in the shop. We do it like every year. And then we also do a sneak peek at the show when we get set up. So that gives you guys an opportunity if you're coming to Nationals and you see something in cases you want, which has worked very well in the past. We've had a lot of sales for just sneak peeking a lot of people saying hey can you hold that for me i'll be there day saturday or friday and i'll pick it up so it gives you guys the opportunity we'll do that and um give you guys an idea what we'll be carrying with us to nashville so we're excited everything's in motion keeping busy um i guess for those of you that are cubs fans and i'm uh, we obviously you guys know we're cardinals fans Hope you guys enjoy as of today. You guys are 10 games up in first place. I'm gonna get a little baseball talk, a little sports talk real quick. So load it up, enjoy it. Until you win that World Series, you can't really talk. That's how I look at it. You gotta win a World Series. And as a Cardinals fan, I don't want you guys to win a World Series in my lifetime. I think it's great that you guys don't. But as a sports fan, a baseball fan, I think it'll be incredible for the game of baseball. So you guys win one, so that's just me being the genuine part of me towards Cubs fans. I actually respect the organization of the Cubs. I really do. I don't dislike them at all. I respect the fan base. I have a lot of Cubs friends and we've talked for years. So, so congratulations, Cubs. I know Will Dawkins is a Cubs fan. Um, I'm trying to think. Um, I know um, uh, Mario, you're a Cubs slash White Sox. I mean, you're just a Chicago fan. I can never keep up with you. Um, and then there's a lot of people I'm missing, but I'm just kind of ramble on. Steve, my dad, blah, blah, blah. On to hockey. Blues lost, but it was fun watching the playoffs. I got into hockey hardcore this year. Uh, it was cool to see that. Went to game one of the conference finals with my wife. That was cool to go to, and they won. And then after that, they didn't play. They actually didn't play well that game. But. And then basketball. Room for the Cavs. Lost last night, but uh, expected a mountain to come back. So go, go Cavs. And football. Ah, ooh, Skull Vikings, new stadium, excited. So, I don't know, I'm just rambling on, getting a little one-on-one -on -one with you guys. Again, hope everybody's doing well. Follow us on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Obviously, we social media on those three avenues every single day. We keep you updated. It's, I hate to say it, it's so much easier and convenient to do everything like snapshot, picture, post, Bob, done. Video is just harder. Got to find that time. It seems like you guys spend more time in my car these days than at the shop. So I apologize for that. So again, thank you everybody for the kind words. We're very excited to be parents, and uh, we'll get you a lot of videos weekend and a busy couple months coming up or busy June. And the Nationals will obviously be getting a lot more videos talking about Nationals again. Everybody have a good weekend, and as always, see you at school.